uh, truthfully talking about my story i'm simply a product of graces it was in 2019 at from rags to riches that i met with dr Obon king in his hotel after the program and i remember i brought him a gift and then he would ask me i just came to say thank you for the impact in my life you know in Tinkation 2018 and following his teachings all the way honestly i didn't have anything in mind just wanted to establish a relationship and say thank you and i remember he asked me to sit by his side in the bed and he asked me what do you want honestly i was blank and then he spoke and he said the favor upon my life i put it upon you and he said the whole number of things but that's that's the remarkable one i remember i said the favor upon my life in all the places i have gone to i put it upon you and i remember i exclaimed amen because i truly believe truthfully that began a relationship that led to a whole lot of things now Sometime in 2020, I think that was during the Easter period, doctor called me up and said he would like to do a, an Instagram live with me. And then before the time, nobody knew who I was. Uh, the Mr. Ken brand, nobody knew the face behind the brand. A lot of them thought I was this very old man because of the Mr. Ken. And somehow when I speak with people, it's just a grace that I sound older than my age. So I was worried because I felt that when people see my face, they'll say, ah, is it this small boy we've been talking with? But I was shocked by the reaction of the video that after the video, people who I felt respected me, they didn't respect me any less. They actually did respect me more. And what that interview session did for me was to bring me to the limelight to a reasonable extent that people were able to put a face to the name. And then people who didn't trust the brand because they didn't know the name were now able to trust the brand, right? So he did a lot for me that after that, he gave me some level of counsel on how to be able to manage the excess orders and everything. And that was what brought us to Enugu in 2020 because the store, the market was no longer able to process our orders at the time. I mean, myself was in the business. My brothers also joined me in the business. And then the store was not able to serve our customers adequately in that 2020 we thought about expanding and then the holy spirit said move to enugu and that was how we opened up the facility in enugu and it became a a, a footstone for every other person to begin to open and branch out to different states of the country that was it for us in 2021 we're able to put up systems as dr ubon king advised put up systems that make that I was no longer the one who is going to interact with the customer, take the other process and dispatch. We now have people from the point of confirming availability, to the point of taking order, to the point of processing order, to the point of dispatching order, to the point of follow-up. We now have a structure that now helped me as well to be able to think outside the box 